On this National EMS Week, the Fort Worth Fire Department and MedStar want you to know how you can help them save a life. New at 4.30, photojournalist Mike Kinney takes us inside EMS training to see their new life-saving equipment. We're here at Fort Worth Fire Station 17, kicking off EMS Week here in the city of Fort Worth. When we get on scene uh, on a cardiac arrest, we've all got our roles to play, much like a pit crew in NASCAR. We work with, with MedStar every day on, on all the medical calls that we go on. Two, three, come on under. Uh, we practice on a regular basis. When we do get to the real thing, there are no hiccups. We've actually got two new pieces of equipment that we're rolling out here with the Fort Worth Fire Department. The first one is our new Zoll monitors. All right, guys, everybody clear? That gives us the capabilities of doing EKGs uh, on scene. Two minutes in. The other piece of equipment is this automated CPR machine. What that does is it provides perfect CPR really forever. The automatic CPR machine really makes good CPR much easier. Everybody clear? Clear. Impressions are so important, and that's why teaching the hands-only CPR to bystanders is, is really a, a vital thing to do. Um, if you don't know CPR, find a class. Bystander first responders are the most important component of any EMS system. It generally will take four to six minutes to get any actual medical personnel on the scene of a call. So taking a hands-only CPR course, taking a stop the bleed training program, those are the two things that with very little investment of time, a bystander becomes a first responder and can save a life. Very interesting look inside there. Ready to help? If you want to learn hands only CPR or how to stop the bleed, the fire department and MedStar, along with Cook Children's Hospital, will be teaching the free classes at Sundance Square this Thursday from noon to 1 and from 5 to 6 o'clock.